Evacuation. Evacuation. Anyone who's not a Spartan is surely going to die by everybody's hand. There's a watcher over there. The SMG is actually pretty good. And we're going to have fun. I actually just noticed that the uh, HP bar actually is below the uh, shield bars. So I guess that's something new I learned. Hello to everybody and oh, thanks. Part seven. Thank you, the AI knows how, knows how to get on ledges. Heal me, please. They, they know at least, they they, 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 they know how to heal at least, and they also know how to, uh, get up on ledges. Oh, whoa, 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 hey, 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 boy, <laughs> boy, man, how was that, what was that all about? I don't know what that was all about, but, uh, it's about something. All right, so we're almost at get out of we're almost in the out of here zone. Well, hopefully we're almost in the out of here zone, because we have an, if we have another wave, then it's gonna be pretty obvious that we cut. As much as I don't want to cut, I'm gonna have to cut eventually. Oi, mate! That's cool, mate. <laughs> ooh, ooh, Mitter melee. Nice. Air is clear. Tanaka, how do we get the elevator moving? Find the control panel. It must be here somewhere. Yeah, no need, no need to be, you know, an idiot in finding it, for it is right here. Very convenient. Very Got sound. It. Very cool. Because how else are we supposed to find an elevator somewhere? Said a change is coming. We know Cortana contacted him. Is she on the Guardian too? Master Chief seemed to think so. So if she's there, then where are they going? We'll find out once we're to the Pelican. I understand the Master Chief disobeying orders to find Cortana, but why the rest of Blue Team? They didn't know her. The members of Blue Team grew up together in the Spartan 2 program. They've registered more operations than any other fire team in the UNSC. Her family. Exactly. Man, I wish we'd known them, like, earlier. But I guess they're characters that just come up. Yeah, how did I... Why am I absolutely and utterly and... And positively not surprised that Prometheans would be here? You know, I guess it's a good thing that we're not fighting Prometheans whenever we're Chief. Speaking of which, I hope we, well, I hope we actually get to be Chief soon, because... The Halo series is nothing without Chief, man. Like, how do you, how do you have a Halo Five, and you have Chief on the, and you have Chief on the art without Chief, without Chief for like most, for like most of the things so far. I don't know, man. But that keeps me up at night. And also, how do they, how do they make the light rifle sound? Like a pew pew laser gun this time around. Like, whenever you're not shooting it. Like, if it's not in the, uh... Actually, no, no matter how you shoot it. Like, whether you're in sniper mode or in, like, regular mode, you're like... It's like a pew 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 laser. And it doesn't have to... Pew pew! It doesn't have that alien... I just bumped my microphone. It doesn't have... It doesn't have that... Mystique. It doesn't have that... Again, crunch. It doesn't have anything like that, so I'm like, why? New Alexandria all over again. We claw our way out here, scratch a life out of the dirt for what? So we can run? Leave it all behind? There's a difference between running and living to fight another day. Tanaka's right. Humanity's at our best when we're making something out of nothing. We're tenacious. We'll rebuild as many times as we have to. Approaching level 
I'm teabagging. Ah, shit. Here we go again, boys. I suppose if there's nothing else to be said. Wow. I honestly thought I would be able to kill those guys. But I guess not. I guess so. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Oh, uh, that's cool. Got it. <laughs> Hello? Can anyone hear me? I'm at Meridian Station. Everyone's dead. Governor Sloan isn't here. I... I... Please. Is there anyone left here but me? Sloan just up and abandoned his people? If Cortana's really behind that Guardian moving, she did more damage here than him. We'll find the truth about what happened here. And we'll make certain that those who should answer for it do. Watch out! More for me. Ooh. Yes. Yes. I so agree with that. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Yes. So we got another night here. Cool. I mean, if this were Spartan Ops, I'd be like, oh god, make it stop. Make it end. But I'm not asking that this time around. Hey, 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 let me... <laughs> Can I have done an assassination door? Come on, guy. Oh, wait. Never mind. Veil. Veil! Veil! Oh. Well. Dang, I guess we got a little uh, mini boss up ahead, though. But do I really have to sit through this cutscene again? Yeah, I do. Yeah, boy! Only like two nights and one like super night. I'm gonna call them super nights. What's that about? Maybe a signal of some kind. Building up to something. Ooh. Guardian, please. Heads up. That thing's starting to move. Oh lordy. I don't know what's going on. Oh, wait. Did you stop? Oh hell. Take cover. Oh no. Oh lordy. Everyone all right? Oh lordy. The structure is still secure enough to climb? If it's gonna fall, won't be because Spartans are using it as a jungle gym. Oh god. The guardian. Oh lordy. Oh look at that thing! Pelican's a few more super wrongs up from here. Jesus that, Christ! More than you want it to be, not as far as it could be. Oh my god. Gotta get out of here. Where where is where is here? Where is there? Okay. Follow the guys, follow the guys, follow the guys. Okay. Ooh, boy. That thing looks cool. Like, I like seeing some weird Stay new alien Stay stuff. Me. Like, I, I love seeing my uh, weird, weird science fiction aliens. Like, I really like it. I don't know what their ultimate purpose is. But they better be cool. Otherwise, I'm going to be very, very upset. Okay, we're heading up in the right direction, at least. I'm just going to ignore these guys. God, <laughs> this is... This is a uh, very reminiscent of a part that I really like in Final Fantasy VII Remake. Not gonna say which part it is, but it involves climbing. And they have sort of the same scenery too. It's like, oh my god. Oh, okay. 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 I see. 
somehow. Well, if we're not going to do anything else with this, then we're going to fight. Sometimes we just got to. All right. Let's uh, do this. Let's do this. Shoot him in the nuts. Come on, mate. Yeah. Hey, mates. At least they aren't as anno at least the watchers aren't annoying to deal with this time around. Like, may not have seen it since I really only talked about what's actually in there. But watchers, God. Oh God, watchers are like anno were like the most annoying thing to deal with. The Pelicans just outside. Holy shit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Move it. I don't want to find out. Get to the Pelican. Oh my god. This looks cool. That look that guy looks cool. following Meridian. It's 11 colonies. I need a means to stop this now. The Warden confirmed Dr. Halsey's theory. Cortana is activating the Guardians. But not this one. Not yet. So now on a pre-covenant religious site on San Helios. It's a Guardian on the elite homeworld? If we can get a team on the ground, we can access that Guardian. San Helios is off limits. Brass wants nothing to do with the Arbiter's War. That's because they haven't heard my great idea. That noise is an encoded numerical pattern. Paired quantum phase sets. Slip space coordinates for a forerunner map. If Locke's team could feed the Guardian the coordinates recorded on Meridian, it would take them to the same place Cortana took Master Chief. Tom, we can stop this. But it means going to Zang Helios. I'll make arrangements. There's another one. What's Cortana up to, Chief? Why'd she bring us here? Let's keep moving. traffic on any band. No long-range uplinks at all. Long way from nowhere, then. We were brought to this location for a reason. Search ahead. Back in chief. Lit up as I Here we go. <laughs> what was that? It came from the console. How many years has it been since we used that signal? It's been like 2,000 years since you've used that signal. Ever since you were captured by Halsey to save the world. Cortana. Cortana, do you read? 
no response. Well, duh, no response, man. What is this place? Forerunner planet. Beyond that, who knows? Wherever we are, Cortana brought us here. She's out there somewhere. Chief, back on Meridian, there was a lot of destruction. There were civilians. I know. She may not have known what would happen. And if she did? We'll learn what's going on once we find her. Locate Cortana. Maybe we'll finally get answers as to why the hell she's doing this shit. Bio readings are unlike anything we've previously recorded. There's a formalness and precision to it all. It seems artificial, but still organic. Halsey would have already started taking samples. She'd have probably figured out the exact coordinates of this planet by now. Yeah, the exact coordinates, a.k.a. Keeping up a running, running commentary on how beautiful this place is. If nothing else, Halo games look pretty. And that's all that matters. Accessing that console activated that large structure. Given the signal we heard, you think she's over there? Possible. And you know what? That leads me into a thing. So, oh boy, we got elites. Oh boy. Before I get to my point. How? How did that not? Unless that did. I was wondering why it didn't get a headshot, but I guess it did. But anyway. My point is that these kinds of graphics we've been seeing a whole lot more of in uh, common games, really. In more and more games as we continue on with evolving our tech. I mean, at this point in time... As this video goes up, the Xbox Series X is being hyped up. PS5 is coming out soon. And we got a whole bunch of games coming that look, you know, undoubtedly great. However. However. They just kind of all look the same. With Halo being the exception. Because it's stuck in its own little sci-fi universe. Seem confused. I don't think they've been here long. Yeah, I guess that's great. But yeah, oh, it's like ready up. It's like like these 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 upcoming games. Oh god, Phantom. These upcoming games like really do look good. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie about that and just say that you know we're we're pushing we're pushing technology. We are very much pushing technology. Like Kingdom Hearts three. I want, I, want, I want to pull this up, if light works will allow me. Look at how, look at how gorgeous the Pirate's World looks. Like, that is actual graphics right there. We, you, are not, you weren't seeing a movie in Kingdom Hearts 3. The Pirate World looks great in Kingdom Hearts 3. But, and it really goes to show how far... Uh, technology has come in simulating these realistic looking graphics. If you can simulate, you know, the realistic movie that is <laughs> the realistic, stupid, and yet fun movie that is Pirates at World's End. Like, you can simulate that just fine. But, like, but like, I'm starting to think that all these, all these realistic, good looking games, like, even stuff that, like, even stuff that goes, that goes into the category of being really good exclusives, like Last of Us Part Two, uh, Ghost of Tsushima, Tsushima, uh, those games undoubtedly look great, but, you know, compared to all these other games that have realistic looking environments, I think we're starting to lose the, we're, we're starting to lose the fact that games can have a unique art style. 
I think Halo is just sort of the exception because it's in its own little sci-fi universe. Like, they can, they can pull off these amazing environments. Like, look at this. Like, look at this. You don't see that in these, in these sort of games. Like, feel free to tell me that I'm stupid and, and I'm not getting a PS5 at launch, and I'm not. I wait a year for that, which is why I got my Nintendo Switch at launch. <laughs> but, like, again, this looks amazing. And all these other really good games, all these games coming out now, they look amazing too. But, when all blended in together, they really look the same. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. We could use more unique art style in the world. No. Just saying that right now. Anyway. Uh, oh, God. They got a fuel rod. Yes, they do. That guy only has a plasma pistol. Well, we're, we're, we're kind of... Only kind of working with plasma pistols right now, actually. And I'm out of storm rifle, so that's unfortunate. Uh, if one of you guys can actually help me out with all of this, please. Well, I suppose I should thank myself. Aha! Oh yeah, you think you're an important character? You think I you think I'm not worthy of this place? Well guess what? Haha! -ha. I am important because my mommy says I'm important. Uh I am seriously out of ammo now for everything. All I have is a plasma pistol. Well, I knew this day would come. The day in which I would have to solely rely. On the beam rifle, okay. <laughs> and here I was about to say, I had to rely on the plasma pistol. Ha! Those days are over, man. Like, I've learned the usefulness that it... I've learned how plasma pistols can actually be useful against, you know, the bigger enemies. Like, you can take out their, their whole shields with them. So, I understand that concept. Can you please stop moving? I understand that concept, but... Jeez, man. That time in which... It goes back to a time in which I used to over-rely on plasma pistols. Everyone complained about how I u nearly ev Nearly everybody complained about how I used the plasma pistols only to get what I needed. Just nipping at my heels. And you know, I appreciate that. But that also made me regret ever playing Halo in the first place. <laughs> I mean, I don't ever regret it, like, truly. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just saying. Blind Let's Plays are both a blessing because you get to experience a game for the first time and, you know, potentially you could get, like, a ton of, ton of views out of it. I'm down. However, they're a curse because, because, you know, you'll get people complaining that, you know, you're not playing a game correctly, even though your, your play style... Could someone have healed me? Could someone have honestly healed me? Why did it put me all the way back back to the thing? So, yeah, blessing and a curse. You know, if it's one thing I learned about about playing these games in segments for YouTube is that, you know, it comes with a blessing and a stigma. You know, I'm, I'm just saying, like, I appreciate, I appreciate all, all that, everything, every, I appreciate everyone who watches these, like, I really do, but I'm saying it's also a stigma, because you're being told how to play the game, <laughs> even though it is right sometimes. Well, I seriously don't know why uh, the video game would put me all the way back here. Especially after a section. I'm just expecting a checkpoint. I'm a noob, I know. I'm, I'm terrible at video games. But... Eh. Wait, where's... Hello? Oh, it's you, little guy. <laughs> well, there you go. Oh, 
Yeah, I just had to go a little bit further. It's the demon. Yeah, it's the beast. I'm I've come to rule the earth for seven years. The end is nigh. <laughs> they really do sound like those uh really cool gamer dudes from RVB. Which I honestly thought that's how the series was gonna go. Like it was gonna end. The main cast was just gonna end with them just logging off of Xbox Live after making up all their little stories. But instead it became all instead it became its own thing, and I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm like, what? I guess if there's one thing that I can be thankful for for the team-based gameplay is the fact that, you know, I'm not being shot at all the time, so I guess that's okay. Ooh, fuel rod. All right. Let's, uh, get these guys. And then we might possibly call it a day. Ooh, who did that? Oh, all right. Come on, get him. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'm just going to deal with these guys and then we're going to call it a day. Oh, the carbine actually works out pretty good. Good for me, actually. I, I like I like its rapid fire nature, but also, you know, the fact that you can snipe with it too is also a bonus. It's neat. <laughs> really, you thought? <laughs> also, explosion damage, please. What's that? Oh, what is that, sir? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, God! Being pinned. Huh? Oh, oh, oh. What, sir? What, sir? Ooh, baby, baby. This is gonna be dicey. This is gonna be dicey. This is gonna be dicey. Sometimes I just gotta rely on my good old standby, the plasma pistol. Ugh, God. Wait a minute, what the frick do those turns sound like? What do they sound like? Do they sound like... What? Did I just really hear them sound like... Instead of being pew 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 pew. I mean, I expected pew pew pew. But not like that. You really can't tell me that the sound design is that weak. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Give me that. You know what? Never mind. My team is pretty much dead anyway. Because it's way too hot here. It's gonna be cool. Yeah. So today ends in the failure, but it's going to end just like we haven't already gone over there already, Jesus Christ. Okay, see you guys on next time. Thank you for watching, and...